Okay, so really quick, my thoughts on Love is Blind season six, the situation between Clay and AD. I feel like I wish that Clay would have told AD sooner, like before she put the wedding dress on and was googly eyed and giggling and just looking stupid. I wish that, you know, he would have told her he didn't want to marry her just like um, Bob the Burger uh, did to Megan Fox number three. I wish, huh? Bob, Bob Burger. Burgers, Bob the Builder, child, whatever the fuck the nigga is, his head is the size of a family guy cartoon characters very square like it doesn't even matter scratch that but anyway i feel like he should have told her before they got to this point but i do respect the fact that he was real enough to say that i'm not ready for marriage you're not ready for marriage you want to be a whore and blame your dad like you want to be out all night come home whenever you feel like it and lie to somebody about it like it, girl it's okay it's all right don't be delusional don't ignore red flags from now on accept them as they are i know life lessons all the girls have to learn shout out to clay's mama the hug before ad walked away was much needed and appreciated because oftentimes it feels like now you've made the other family an adversary in situations like this so that felt good and P.S. Clay's daddy still ain't shit because he showed up trying to make this about him being a trace. So they come back about you running. This ain't about that. Talk about how you took your son and cheat on your wife and now he got to go to therapy in order for him to be able to be a good man in a marriage to somebody. Talk about that. Fucking track star. Nigga, run away from me with this. Now can I get a hug? No, you can't get no goddamn hug, nigga. I feel sorry for her because I know she's going to make this about herself. She even said, it's just never enough. Y'all, I have said that so many times in my life that broke my heart for her to say that because this man was never going to be what she needed for him to be. He was really just trying to make it to the end of the show just like she was. It just so happens that she allowed herself to really fall for him and he just couldn't fall for her. Look, saying I ain't going nowhere, let me know he's trying to leave the door open to come and clap them cheeks whenever he feel like it. At least his mama got a chance to say her peace to the daddy, especially since she just finding out that her son was taking on these secret rendezvous for him to go and cheat. You are enough, AD. Stop looking for these men to be a happily ever after for you and find a happily forever in your experience in this life. And that should not be tied to another human being at the end of the day, girl. Please find some love within yourself because this is so sad that you feel like you were so close to what exactly? Becoming a wife of a man that's going to dog you out? Learn from this. Learn from it.